we are going to talk about supply curve and its slope over here so what is supply curve it is the graphical representation of supply schedule that means whatever supply schedule is given to you whether it is market supply schedule or it is individual supply schedule when we uh, you could say ki uh, represent that supply schedule that means uh, data in the form of a graph it is called or you could say ki it is called as the supply curve okay so supply curve could be of two types individual supply curve okay and market supply curve fine so first we'll be talking about individual supply curve okay so so individual supply curve is the representation of a single firm in the form of graph that means single firm is represented in the form of graph okay that means the given data is represented of a single firm in the form of graph we call it as individual supply curve fine so uh, what will be the shape of individual supply curve the supply curve is always forward moving okay that means it is always moving upward supply will be more when price will be more supply will be less when the price is less okay now for example now for individual supply curve we are following the same firms data firm a when the price was rupees 5 the firm was not ready to uh, sell anything in the market when the price rose to 10 rupees uh, the firm supplied 10 units 15 who are priced so it was ready to supply 20 units when the price was 20 uh, 20 rupees per product that means the firm supplied 30 units now we are going to plot this particular data of firm a that means individual supply curve we are constructing now when uh, we are expressing quantity on x axis and price we are taking on y axis now when the price was rupees 5 the quantity was zero price was rupees 5 the quantity was zero so we are standing over here this is the point okay now when the price rose to rupees 10 okay when the price rose to rupees 10 so the firm uh, was ready was willing to uh, sell 10 units in the market that means over here we are standing over here okay this is a price 10 and quantity is 10 units now when the price rose to 15 okay and the firm was ready to sell 20 units fine we are over here now extending it 25 and say 30 over here okay now when the price rose to 20 rupees the firm supplied 30 units price rose to 20 so the firm was ready to sell 30 units in the market okay we are standing over here suppose now when we join all these points we get a straight line like this so this line represents the supply curve okay supply curve is always positive uh, is having a positive slope because it is rising upward so it is having a positive 
slope okay because with rise in price quantity supplied is also increasing so the shape of the supply curve is positive slope it is positive sloping supply curve now the next is market supply curve so what is market supply curve when we represent market uh, supply schedule on a graph it is called market supply curve now market supply may we are having more than one firm okay it is the supply schedule of more than one firm that means we are taking for example firm a and firm b similar data we are taking price was rupees 5 quantity supplied by a is 0 b is 0 and when we add both of the both the quantities of a and b we get the market supply then uh, uh, this is price rise to 10 rupees firm a is uh, uh, supplying 10 units it is supplying 5 units and when we add it we get 15 so similar in similar way we are adding all the uh, supply of uh, supply of both the firms and we are making the supply schedule of uh, market supply schedule now we will be plotting for first a and first then b firm in the market uh, on a graph so for the first uh, uh, firm a that means the in the first graph we will be plotting it for a firm so when the price was 5 rupees the quantity supplied was 0 so we are standing over here okay then 10 and 10 price is rupees 10 supply is quantity supplied is 10 then price is 15 quantity supplied is 20 units over here we are standing okay then price is 20 quantity supplied is 30 units so over here we are standing okay now when we join this is the supply schedule of firm a okay now we are going to plot the supply schedule of firm b when the price was rupees 5 quantity was 0 that means firm b b was also not supplying anything when the price was 10 the firm was supplying only 5 units over here when the price was 15 firm was supplying 10 units 15 pay 10 units supply karti hai when the price rose to 20 the firm is supplying 15 units okay now we are standing over here 15 over here fine so this is the supply schedule of firm b fine supply schedule of firm b fine now this is uh, the market supply schedule is the summation of a and b firm now we are going to plot for both the summation of for both the firms now when the price was rupees 5 market supply schedule was uh, 0 we were getting quantity uh, supplied in the market was 0 so at rupees 5 zero quantity was supplied then 10 and 15 when the price was 10 15 units were supplied we are standing over here so this is the point at 15 rupees 30 units 15 and 30 this is the point 20 and 45 20 rupees pe 45 units both the firms combinedly okay now when we join these points we get a market supply curve fine 